Baggage allowance, the installation, includes seven multimedia works. Bag x-ray, weeping steamer trunk, suitcase, Holly's patent, a single channel baggage allowance video, sonic suitcases, and tape loops. Bag x-ray. Visitors are asked to place their bags on a moving conveyor belt. As the bags appear to be x-rayed, they show up on the display, revealing surprise objects. When a bag enters the enclosure, a camera grabs its image. The computer analyzes it for size and shape, selects from a database of images, and superimposes a size-appropriate object on the bag. Available objects include a pistol, an engraved knife, a chest x-ray with a beating heart, hypodermic needles, an emmy, small live animals, and a number of other unlikely objects. Weeping Steamer Trunk An antique steamer trunk stands open with a blurred moving image pulsating through a cameo-shaped display. As the visitor opens the various drawers, images come into focus and audio is heard through the speakers embedded in the trunk's upholstery. A pair of underwear for each day. Two long-sleeved t-shirts. Leggings. An outfit for performing. Shoes or boots for performing. Actual objects tucked in the drawers also become visible when the drawers are opened. A variety of objects are revealed, including a tiny model of a Victrola, an old throat ice bag, a drawer filled to the top with hair, a small locket containing photos of the artist's parents, a pair of white gloves, and a drawer filled with the artist's old family photos. Suitcase A woman sleeps fitfully under a blanket in a small suitcase. When visitors approach, they look down into the suitcase, and if they lean close, they can hear a collage of her frantic, worrisome thoughts as she sleeps, or the rustling of the blanket and her breathing when she occasionally wakes and looks directly at them. Holly's Patent Two channels of HD video are projected into a corner over which a sound dome is hanging. The video displays a collage of weathered, disintegrating travel stickers from an antique steamer trunk from the early 1900s. Over a bed of minimal looped melodic fragments, a voice is heard in one channel reading the details from an actual patent application of inventor Eugene H. Hawley, who invented some of the trunk's locking hardware. In the other audio channel, a list of cities and hotel names are read, chronicling the travels of a woman who presumably once owned the trunk. The audio can only be heard clearly when a visitor stands below the sound dome, which is positioned centered at an appropriate viewing distance from the corner. 
Grand Hotel Suisse, Bad Ragaz. Hotel Savoy Majestic, Genova. Lloyd Hotel, Amsterdam. Baggage Allowance. A single channel wide HD video composition with a stereo collaged text score is projected on a white wall in a semi enclosed space in the gallery. Two pants, two or three shirts, camisoles, maybe another jacket, a vest. I usually always have a vest. Either warm or wet clothing, one or two pair of blue jeans folded, and sometimes a pair of pajamas. One or two skirts, one pair of dress pants, one pair of jeans, maybe one sexy nighty, depending on what's going to happen. Socks. Um, and socks. 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 Pairs of socks. Just enough socks and underwear. See, I almost forgot These the boots. socks. So I, I Ski wear. boots. Underwear. One pair of big boots. I'll always fit it really comfortable. If it's winter, I would wear high heel boots. Uh, shoes. Much yeah, yeah, if I could have a neck. I've tried to the past 20 years or so. Keep it down to one pair of shoes. I always wear the same shoes. Another pair of shoes. One extra pair. Just one pair of shoes and a pair of sandals. Probably two pairs of comfortable shoes. Three bras. Two bras. Just shoes. Have their own bag. Toiletries with Otherwise, I'll try the book my that I, Two notebooks. That I write one that's a writing notebook and one that's for drawing. Tools or notebooks. Book. Tape loops. Two open reel tape decks sit on pedestals with long tape loops running over brackets mounted on a wall. One tape deck quietly plays a loop of a story describing the artist's long history of keeping and transporting an old reel to reel tape deck. The other quietly plays a loop that lists all the dates and places where the tape deck was transported and stored over a span of three decades. Sonic Suitcases Six valises and trunks with speakers mounted on or tucked inside of them are arranged on the gallery floor. Sounds, such as a phone ringing, words such as size and weight descriptors, and sentences quoted from airline baggage security questions play quietly through the speakers with long gaps of silence in between. Each speaker has a separate looping track. The tracks vary in length, so that the resulting spare collage constantly changes.